Hi, Forever family. How are you feeling? I hope you're already noticing positive shifts after completing day one. We're doing this with you. In fact, this is the 11th time that I have done a revision of DX4, and I'm feeling a little hungry. It's totally normal. As you go into day two, you may feel a little hungry, but I promise you, you are not starving. Stick to the supplements and you are on the road to change. I have no doubt. The theme for day two is define. Your second day of DX4 is about defining your area of focus from day one in the context of SMART goal framework. You may have heard of a SMART goal, or maybe not, and that's okay. I'm gonna walk you through what a SMART goal is and how it applies to DX4. But first, it's important to note that today you're gonna to continue fasting and taking the nutritional products and supplements in the program, just like you did on day one. You'll find a complete schedule for day two on page 10 of your booklet. Please be smart and listen to your body. Completing day two following the schedule it is written is ideal. However, if eating something is absolutely necessary to help you complete the program, please reference the DX4 program approved snack, which you can find on page 27 of your booklet. Now let's dive into SMART goals. This type of goal setting helps you give a more fine-tuned framework around your goal. It's an acronym that stands for Specific, Measurable, Attainable, Relevant, and Time-bound. By defining a SMART goal, you remove any ambiguity around your goal, which gives you a clear idea of what you want and how to achieve it. So, what does a SMART goal look like? A vague goal would sound like, I will improve my diet, but now it takes on a new meaning through the SMART goal lens. It might look something now like, I will eat at home five nights a week for the next month. On pages 14 and 15 in your DX4 booklet, you'll find a more in-depth explanation of SMART goals and be guided on how to turn your DX4 goal into a SMART goal. Remember to have your journal or an electronic device handy to do your day two assignment, which will be outlining your SMART goal and celebrating another small victory for today. You'll also end today with an affirmation inspired by your SMART goal and gratitude for what you experienced today. When you do this, think about what changes you're noticing in your mind and your body and continue to remain open-minded so that the new ideas and feelings flow freely. Before ending day two, it's a great idea to prep for day three. Look ahead to see what you'll need to prepare since you'll begin adding in nutrient-dense food. Preparation is a big part of success and you are well on your way. We'd love to hear what your SMART goal is. Tell us right now in the comments. Share your goals and I'll do my best to share my goal with you.